All right, let's see if I can get my Kenta to work now. Uh, here's where the tricky part's at. I don't know where my thing at to my phone. Let me see if I can find it. I have this tripod. Uh, what do I do with it? Oh, here it is, a little small one. So let's set up the little small thing to my, my phone. And then we're going to see if I can get my... My Kenta to work. Let's see. Okay. So, I was having trouble connecting my 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 um my Kenta. So, we're going to do this all right here. We're going to see. Hopefully, it works. If not, I don't know what to say. Buy a new Kenta. So, I got my Kenta. Get that sucker out. Get the cable out. I'm going to get my tablet out. And my chingali. So I got everything in here. I keep everything in the same thing. Same little box. So, I got the my DMX Go. I got my plugs. I got my tablet. Let's set it up. This will be... This will be wild. I'm gonna check this out and see what happened. What happened? Why am I something didn't work? That's so. Where is my chingling? So, this is the way I had it like this because I didn't charge it. Because I didn't charge it, what I did was plug it up to the to the kenta on the back. Let's see, can you guys see that on the back of the kenta? There's an outlet, so I plug this up like that. And I plug up my my can my um ching link to it. I just plug this up to the wall and see what happens. Plug it up to the wall. Plug it up to the wall. We're gonna find out. We're gonna find out if it's my DMX Go that's having issues. Or is it my chin ring that have any issues? I'm gonna just put this real quick. So I got right now I have it on auto, I'm gonna put it on DMX. So I'm gonna go to the menu. Enter. So I got in a DMX connection. So the little chinglies, the little chinglies, um, have like a little button to turn it on and off. They're not blinking, so it must be off. So I'm gonna turn on the power. And you see a little green light, that means it's charging. So let me turn the power on. So what I do, I just get a little, another little thing that I could stick in. I should get like a pin in here in my, in my setup. So here goes, here goes how you turn the power on. You hit the, pump, the little button in there. So now it's on. See, it's blinking pink. I'm going to turn on my tablet. <sighs> when my tablet turns on, it should blink. It should blink green. So now let's look up my DMX. I need this stuff right here to hook up my DMX. <sighs> We're gonna figure this junk out. Let's hook up my DMX. 
So I'm gonna hook up my USB connection to my Look at my DMX So I got this hooked up already And I'm gonna look at power Where's the power? Hmm, I can't reach over there I'm gonna have to take that down on the ground So I got a little outlet, six outlet right here on the ground So I'm gonna hook it up right here So this hooks up to the back of this, just like that. This hook up to this on channel one, just like that. And then we're gonna hit hook up power to this, just like that. So everything should be working out. And my light should be blinking green if it made a connection. Okay, see, now it's working. It wasn't working at the party, and I turned it off. <sighs> so let me hook up my, turn on my tablet. Let's see what happens. I'm gonna be so mad if it works. I'm gonna be so mad. So that's sending the signal over to my chingy now. It's sending the signal over to my chingy. And as soon as I turn this on, it should send the signal to the DMX to make a connection. So let's turn on the tablet. I got a cheap Amazon tablet, but the little cheap, I mean, I'm, I'm not saying cheap as in quality, I'm talking about cheap as in price. 40 bucks tablet. I'm telling you, man, when I got there, it was five o'clock, so there was sunlight. So I couldn't really see this blinking because it was so bright outside. But when it started getting dark, that's when I noticed it wasn't making a connection. And I didn't really have time to troubleshoot. You know, I had like, so what I did, I just put the lights, I took it off of DMX and just put it on auto sound. So here, he, I, what I do is I click on settings. And then I am gonna go to uh, this internet thing. And then I'm gonna go to Wi-Fi. So right now it's connected to my CenturyLink. I'm gonna connect it to my DMX, Smart DMX. So now it's connecting, it says connecting, connecting, authorizing, connecting, obtaining IP, IP address. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Connecting to the internet, boom, no internet connected. So we're good here. And I'm gonna to connect to my DMX. So if it works, that thing's gonna blink. If it makes a connection, it should blink. Let's see, right now it's white. I'm gonna allow the sound. Allow that puppy. And see, look at that. Look, cross your fingers. Cross your fingers. And stop. What does that mean? Ah, there's an error. There's an error. So let's cut and let's start again. So clear everything up. Let's start again. See, this stuff ain't perfect. That's why I always don't recommend stuff. I don't want people saying, DJ City Miners, you recommended this and this is a piece of crap. It doesn't work. That's why your boy doesn't recommend stuff. You got to take your own risk. I took my own risk in buying this. And I took my own risk in buying all this junk. I took a risk in buying this laptop. You gotta take your own risk. You know what I'm saying? If it doesn't work, then hey, it is what it is. So, I don't know if making a connection, nothing's moving. So, that means I need to turn this on and see if I get any connection. Turn this off. Let's find out. Let's see if I can connect this to this light. Should be blinking green. It is blinking green. That's not even making a connection. So I got some, some problems. 
All right, so next plan. I don't, I didn't put the antenna on because I was being lazy. But the antenna sent the signal from the my my tablet to this. I didn't put the antenna on. I was being lazy. So what am I gonna do next? Let's shut it off and turn it back on. Turn it off and then turn it back on. I'm gonna count a few seconds. Turn it on. And then I'm gonna shut this off and turn it on again. Clear all. Start all over again. Let's see, make I make sure I have a connection. See, I don't have time to be troubleshooting when I'm at a gig. See, like how it's taking time. Um, what am I doing? Internet. Internet. And I'm connected to the CenturyLink. I want to connect to my Smart DMX. My Smart DMX is not showing up. Did I get the power on? There's no power at all. There it is. My head, it was kind of crooked. I'm gonna wait for this Wi Fi to start blinking. Once this Wi Fi starts blinking, I have connection. Nope. All right, let's go see what we got. There it is. Popped up. Let's connect this. Obtaining. IPS. Well, once it connects, I want to make sure that it is connected over here. And this is Wi-Fi, so that's good. And right here it is. Still obtaining? Holy mole. I should pluck up the antenna. Is that being lazy? Where'd it go? It disappeared. I forget to bring the antenna out. Bring the antenna out. Uh, that's what happens when you be lazy. Connect the whole thing together. Let's do it again. Just gonna hook up this little antenna to it. Turn off the power. Oops. <laughs> I was doing it like this. Trying to put it in. <laughs> Alright. Look at this. That's all it. Your boy DJ City Man is starting to get lazy. Lazy. You know what they say? They say the lazy people work double. In Spanish is los flojos trabajan doble. That means the lazy people work double. See, if I would have done this once, I would have been done with, but I was being lazy, so I'm working double. All right, this is blinking, so that's good. This is good. I'm still waiting for the Wi-Fi. Uh, don't tell me my DMX go broke. Did my DMX go broke? Did it break? Connected. Woohoo! Woohoo! Just make sure it's really connected. Wi Fi. See, I'm looking at the Wi Fi. Alright. Cross your fingers now. Turn on my DMX Go. It's gonna ask about my sound. It's gonna say, Do I wanna to connect to the sound? <laughs> it didn't ask about my sound, but the light is working now. So let's turn it, let's turn it green. Green. It's supposed to be green. My color's all screwed up. There it is. Hold up, hold up. Oh no, no, my bad. It's moving, it's changing those colors right there. Green, yellow, blue. Or blue, green, cyan. Green. Blue, cyan, or whatever, you know what I mean. So, yeah, we got the colors there. Now, let's change it to green. Eric is working. What the heck happened? <laughs> ah, see, we're working again. Ah, 
Man, I swear, I was at that gig, couldn't get it to work. See, when it's bright out there, you're like, yeah, wait till it gets dark and then I'll fix it. And they see, you know, the party started at 5. They see, you know, it's 6 o'clock. You're like, I'm trying to get my lights working. And you have to play music and turn and fix the light, play music, turn. And then somebody asks for karaoke, then you're like, oh, no, and then you're doing this. And it's like, you get like, I mean, I need to hire somebody. I need to go with somebody. I need to bring somebody. I'm bringing my daughter. I'm going to say, hey, my daughter, play the song while I figure this out. Just hit play. When the song finished, hit the next song. I'm not sure how to queue up songs. You know? But look, it's working. I'm going to turn into red, slow red. I think the red, this light going to turn red, and this one's going to turn either blue. Let's see. Red. Yeah, red and blue. Everything's working again. And the next one is going to be uh, cyan. And this one, the light right here is going to be cyan. And I believe this color is going to be green. Cyan and green. Everything's working. I don't know what happened. Don't not know what happened. And I set it up just like this. I set it up just like this. Had it like that, plugged up like that. This wasn't blinking. It was pink. I could see that it was pink. And I switched my, my, my chingy. I can always carry two in my little bag. I have another chingy right here. In case one chingy breaks, I have my backup chingy. And my backup chingy didn't work neither. So then I reset the power on this to see if I could get a connection. I reset the power. Didn't work. But these lights were working fine. I had these lights working fine. This wasn't working. It wasn't making a connection. So I just said, you know, forget it. I took the chingy. I, I took off the chingy and I put it in um, auto sound. The auto. Remove the DMX. That's how I managed to get by. So the moral of the story is always have a plan B. <laughs> always have a plan B. Like this didn't work, so I went to plan B, and I just used this because I couldn't get the line to work. So I went to plan B. But I um, always have a plan B. One time I did a gig, and my mixer broke, this one. Now, I didn't have this one, but I had a um, Behringer. Is it Behringer? I think it was a Behringer. It stopped working. It started making a lot of, a lot of uh, static noise. So what I did, my plan B was instead of using this, I went straight from my mixer to my speakers. You know what I mean? So I just got rid of these cables because this is coming from my mixer to this mixer. So I got rid of these cables that went from my, this mixer straight to the speakers. I never done that before. Um, the reason why I like doing it like this, because this have more mics option. Like when she, that's for karaoke, I went like this. Boom, bam, hooked up my, my wireless mic. I ain't have my wireless mic out. I had my other mic with the cord. But as soon as they mentioned karaoke, I would say, give me a few seconds. Boom, hook up my microphone. And I got one of these mics that, um, uh, I don't know if I showed you guys. But they just have like a little transmitter in, um, that you plug up in here. No, 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 receiver. You plug up in here, just stick it right in. That's all you have to do. Just stick it in, turn the power on, and turn on the mic. Like two seconds and you're already hooked up. It takes you longer to get it out of the, the box. Like this is in the box right now. But yeah, it's working. So this is your boy DJ City Manos. And the lesson of the moral of the story is have a plan B. Plan B. Always know. I always tell everybody, know your equipment, know how it works. And in this case, I, the stress, playing music, doing this. It's too bright outside, I couldn't see. The sun was too, still loud. I couldn't troubleshoot my lights because I couldn't see that little pink light. I had to put my hand over the light to make it dark to see. Now, like, oh, that's pink. It's supposed to be green. See, now it's green. Oh, I'm out. Peace.